Hi, my name is Julian and welcome to this FAST activity brought to you by Central Northern Regional Libraries. Today we're going to make paddle pop boats. You will need some paddle pop sticks, a rubber band, some glue, hot glue or wood glue, some scissors and some foam. Mine's from a pool noodle. All right, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is plug in your hot glue gun so it warms up and put that safely out of the way. Uh, and we're going to need to cut two of our paddle pop sticks. So, um, the, I found the best way to do that if you wanna cut them in half is to not just snip them straight through with the scissors, but to try to score them. So I'm gonna pick about the middle here and I'm gonna use the scissors on one end. I'm just gonna to try to score it, which means put a little mark on it. And you can see there, I've got a score mark on it. Now it should snap, and give you a nice clean cut. So do that on the other one as well. Okay, so we've got our two paddle pops cut in half. Now they sit, like we're gonna do some gluing and it's going to sit, look like this. So that's gonna sit there. That's gonna be about halfway along. And then we're gonna use the last one of these as the paddle. All right, um, what we'll do before we glue that is we'll get our foam and we're going to cut four little cubes out of it. So let's, let's do that. Okay, so now I've got four little cubes, roughly the same size, doesn't have to be perfect. And now let's glue it together. Now, if you're using hot glue, this will be fairly quick. If you use uh, some sort of wood glue or craft glue, then it might take a little bit longer to set. You'll have to leave it for a couple of hours. But I'm gonna use hot glue. All right. So I'll glue the top bit on first. I'll glue the middle bit. And while it's still a bit soft, you can square it up to make it look nice and even. And the last bit of gluing is to put these four pieces and glue them on like that. I'll do them one at a time. Now I'll wait a minute for that to dry and then we'll put in our propeller. Now with the rubber band, we're going to put it over, over this section here. So it's simply a matter of putting it over like that and getting our propeller. Winding it up. And that is all wound up, ready to go. Join us next time to make these portrait pots. You will need a terracotta pot, some paints, a plant, maybe a cactus, and you can get some gloss finish to make it pop. 